What are the steps that someone would have to take to make themselves financially indestructible? They're just impenetrable, resilient. Like, yeah. what steps would somebody need to take? Well, for me, my route was find a way to make money. Okay. Keep it, taxes, mm -hmm. and then make it grow. Okay. Right? Which, even in our situations, if you look at that on the macro, we might have made money in different ways. Yeah. But we took the money we made, mm -hmm. tried our best not to pay taxes. Yeah. Legally. Yeah. Because I do pay taxes. That's why I moved to Florida, man. Yeah, exa exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And then you put that money in a vehicle that's going to make it grow and pay you forever. Yeah. You know, now I believe in businesses because business is always going to give you a better return. Yeah. The whole passive income is it's kind, it's of, a small it's kind of like a myth, but like, but, but people yeah. talk about passive income. It's never going to outweigh what you can do earned income, especially yeah. if it's your yeah. business. And that's why I kind of, in a lot of ways, I don't, I don't like to say the word passive income that much. Right. Because I think that, like, when guys hear passive income, they think not working. Yeah, they think oh, I'm just going to be on the beach. My yeah, God. chilling, yeah. chilling. Yeah. Even when I am on the beach, I'm on. You know, Bro, from vibes. the second I wake up yeah. to the second I go down, mm -hmm. I'm on something to do at work. People think it's about money, man. It's not about money at all. Yeah, It's, about it's not game. about the game. That's what it's people don't get. Bro, I would take my relationships with friends and family and like the like. Bro, money is nothing but just a fucking tool. It's, it, it's fuel to put on a fire of your life. It's, it's not, not about that. It's not even the money. The money is just how you try to track it. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Like material things. Like, bro, fuck that Lambo. I have a good life. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, good I, friends, good family. Yeah, friend, friends and freedom. Yeah. yeah. And freedom's way up there for me, man. Just my personality, man. Like, you know, like I never quit working. In fact, I always say that every day is Tuesday to me. Mm. And often I forget the day of the week. I always forget the day of the week. Yeah, bro. Because, <laughs> you know, it don't fucking matter because I'm going to do matter. the same thing. Yeah. And I think that's where a lot of, a lot of guys should really focus is like, Sit down and write down if you could have a perfect day okay. that you'd want to live again and again and again, what would it look like? Uh, and then every day is Tuesday. Yeah. For some people, they would make their day, but they're making it based off of the fact that they had living at income. To really answer that question, you'd be like, what would I do if I had all the money in the world? I was still trying. I like to drive. You know how you meditate? Mm -hmm. I don't meditate, but I drive and I just think. With the, with the radio off? Yeah. I used, to, yeah. Yo, I used to do that shit all the time. Yeah. And I used to drive with the radio off. Yeah. And I would get like my best ideas. I would, you get stuck in your thoughts. Mm -hmm. and, and in my mind, I play like chess with like, so if I do this, this will happen, but then this will happen. Okay, cool. So I'll do it like this. And then I'll make that phone call and I'll be like, hey, move this here, do this. Yeah. Tell them I said this. And they'll be like, Justin, you're making these decisions so fast. I've been, I've been playing this move for three months. That's how you get the best ideas, yeah. man. Like, I mean, honestly, that's one of the, that's the one thing I miss about not driving is those yeah. ideas I'll get driving with the radio off. Yeah, I'll yeah. tell you another thing. You're talking about waking up at four in the morning. Mm -hmm. I feel like if you want to meet God, he's up at 4 a.m. And there's something special about the morning time, watching, the, you know, to watch the sunrise. It's so beautiful, mm -hmm. especially here over the ocean. But I'll tell you what it is, is that you can hear yourself think. Yeah. Because at that time of morning, the, the phone's not buzzing. There's nothing happening. You're quiet. You're in your own thoughts. Yeah. And I think that's really powerful. Like, whether it's God or your own conscious, it's your voice mm -hmm. at four in the morning. Yeah. Especially if you can go outside. We'll see, see it in the sunrise in the morning. It's, yeah. it's super, it's a good way to start. Yeah. Hey, man, well, and then, yeah, and it's too, you feel like so much further ahead of other people. If you can get the ball going in some, and, and get obsessed with being great, yeah, it starts to become fun and you start playing a game with yourself. Exactly. Man. You're like, you know, like, oh, you're chicken checking all these boxes off money fitness style all these different things you know where you live like what you, what you're able to accomplish mm -hmm. and it starts to become fun and you're like okay well what the fuck else can i do yeah i'm starting to believe in this motherfucker me is that you know what i'm saying and that's when it gets fun Same i remember shit. the first time i i realized i had a million dollars in the bank yeah i've been looking down so long you know what i'm saying and yeah. the money was stacking and I looked up one day and I had already passed it like a couple of days before. Yeah. And I was like, oh, be fucking damn. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it's just, it's one of those things where it's like every now and then you look up and you see how far you climb, but all the happiness, man, is, is head down. Yeah. Right.